anywhere without worrying where you are or if it's we are breaking into programming as we are tracking severe weather here at Action News. We do have tornado warnings that have been issued by the National Weather Service. You can see that this encompasses portions of Lancaster County, also working its way into South Central Berks County, and also into North Central Chester County. So we're going to zoom on into here just so you can see a few of the communities. And where we have the red polygon is that tornado warning in itself. So we're looking at, again, parts of Lancaster County, also into Chester County and I'm going to read off the information from this tornado warning. Uh, this was issued by the National Weather Service at 1109 a severe thunderstorm capable of producing both tornadoes and straight line wind damage were located near Honeybrook or nine miles southeast of New Holland, moving northeast at 35 miles per hour. So we again are looking at parts of Lancaster County, also South Central Berks County and North Central Chester County. Now within this warning, nothing has been seen by anybody personally, but this storm is capable again of pr producing a tornado. So we'll go ahead and take a look at the current radar view right now and you can see how active the situation is getting across our viewing area. We have tornado warnings and then also severe thunderstorm warnings, but it's the area right in here, a little difficult to make out with the polygon, but the areas right in here where we do have those strong thunderstorms that are capable of producing a tornado and also straight lines wind damage. So if you are tuning in right now, you do want to make sure that you get into your safe location. We always reiterate when there is a tornado warning, you want to get down into the lowest level of your home, such as a basement. Now I know not everybody has a basement, but what you can do is get into the most interior room of the structure that you're in. That could include a closet or an interior hallway. What you essentially want to be doing is getting away from windows. Anything that could blow glass breaking in a situation like this from a tornado or straight line wind damage could cause some injuries. So you want to stay in this area until the storm is no longer an issue. So again, if you are just tuning in with us now, here on 6ABC, we are on the air as we continue to track severe thunderstorms that are capable of producing a tornado. So I'm going to leave the warning up on here, and I'm also gonna read some of the information that's coming in from the National Weather Service at this hour. This tornado warning is until 1115 in Lancaster County, and then the newly issued tornado warning uh, is until 1145 here, and that does include parts of Chester County and also into parts of Berks County. So as I read some of the information from the actual bulletin from the National Weather Service, some of the locations that they're concerned about could be Birdsboro, also Honeybrook, Elverson, New Morgan, Glenmore, and Pew Town. For anybody that might be on the road or know of somebody that might be traveling, this includes the Pennsylvania Turnpike between mile markers 298 and 308, also along Interstate I uh, 176 in Pennsylvania near mile marker one. So we're continuing to follow the very latest with this uh, tornado report, uh, tornado warning that was issued by the National Weather Service. And just bear with me for a moment as I look at some of the information that's coming in through the chat right now. All right, it looks like if you are in Lancaster County, that warning has been allowed to expire. That warning was until 1115. So now the main area that we're watching here is again into parts of Chester County and also into Berks County. This does include the south central portion of Berks County and also the north central area of Chester County. So we'll go ahead and look at the radar view right now and you can see a very active line that's coming together here. And we'll go ahead and put it on the latest frame so you can see where this line is right now. And here we have that tornado warning. So again, going over uh, some communities like Honeybrook, also into Wallace Township, Elverson. We're looking at routes 401, 322, 
282, also in the area here of St. Peter's Township, Culp Town, and this again, moving its way to the north and east. So anyone that might be joining us right now, you wanna make sure that you are getting into the lowest level of your home. At this point, there has been no tornado confirmed to the National Weather Service, but this is a very dangerous situation for anybody might, that might be in the path of this storm. So here's a look at some of the tips Again, uh, if you are joining us here on 6ABC, you want to seek shelter now. This uh, tornado warning that was issued by the National Weather Service is not just for the fact that there could be a thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado, but we're also looking at the threat of straight line winds. That has been one of our greatest threats for severe weather today. And with those straight line winds, oftentimes you can have just as much destruction as a tornado itself. When you're looking at the threat of winds anywhere from 60 to even 70 miles per hour. So again, you wanna make sure that you are seeking shelter right now as this is a very dangerous situation. Back on radar at the moment here, you can see all of the activity that's coming together and these thunderstorms are going to continue to press their way east. So if you're tuning in from Philadelphia right now, you are in the clear, but these thunderstorms are going to be continuing to move their way toward the city. We're gonna pull up the uh, warning once again. Just bear with me here as I try and get the radar to pause for a moment. And, and all right, now we're gonna try and pull in some areas that are in the path of this thunderstorm. So right now it is moving northeast at about 35 miles per hour. So we're gonna put a tracker on here and populate it to the northeast at 35 miles per hour. So here you go, this gives us a few other communities that are in the path of this severe thunderstorm that's capable of producing a tornado. So if you see or hear me read off your town, you need to be in your safe location right now. 1126 Suffley, so you have about six minutes until the worst of this storm is over your area. 1131 in West Nantmeal Township. 1138 East Nantmeal Township. 1141 in the area of Nantmeal Village and 1145 in South Coventry. So again, if I read off your community, now is the time to be in your safe location as we are dealing with some dangerous storms. So we'll pull this back on radar so we can look again at the uh, movement of the storms that continue to move their way to the northeast at 35 miles per hour. For anybody that might just be switching on to 6ABC or maybe you're streaming from your basement of your home, I'm hoping that's where everyone is right now. We are on the air because there is a tornado warning that has been issued by the National Weather Service. This is for South Central Berks County and North Central Chester County. These are both in southeastern and eastern Pennsylvania. I know things are a little difficult to see here with the radar view, so we'll go ahead and clean up the image for you here so you can see a better polygon view of this tornado warning. So right here in red is where that tornado warning is. And we are looking at the potential of severe thunderstorms that are capable of producing a tornado or hail up to quarter size. So that's where you can see that one inch hail diameter that's possible. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed and there could be damage to roofs, windows and vehicles. Also, we're looking at the threat of tree damage with these thunderstorms that are moving their way again to the north and east at 35 miles per hour.